The Department recognises the importance of monitoring students' development of foundational literacy and numeracy skills in the early years of schooling. To support schools in this critical work, the Department developed Early Start in partnership with the Australian Council for Educational Research. Early Start is the Department's key literacy and numeracy monitoring tool for students in prep to year two and the tasks and resources are designed specifically for a Queensland context. In 2019, the Department partnered with the Australian Council for Educational Research to conduct a rigorous review of the Early Start suite of materials. The review confirmed the currency and validity of Early Start as a best practice monitoring tool and showed that the materials allow teachers to monitor students with a range of abilities and needs, including students with learning difficulties and disabilities, and those of Aboriginal and Torres Strait Islander descent. It is affirming to know that the review further found that the Early Start tasks show appropriate mapping to core skill development as identified in literature for early years literacy and numeracy. Early Start materials are aligned to aspects of the Australian curriculum, allowing teachers to plan for differentiation of literacy and numeracy within planned curriculum delivery, and automatically map to the P10 literacy continuum, allowing teachers to continue to monitor and respond to students' development across the school year. Importantly, as Early Start covers a range of critical aspects in literacy and numeracy, it is invaluable for identifying and confirming through ongoing monitoring students who may require further diagnostic investigation. The high quality, age appropriate, engaging and Queensland contextualised tasks support teachers to implement Early Start with students to monitor and track their literacy and numeracy progress across PrEP to the beginning of Year 3. One of the great benefits of administering Early Start in one school is the range of reports available for analysis. And the student dashboard view in one school provides a quick overview of student literacy and numeracy progress. The department supports school leaders to take a whole of school approach and lead data informed conversations to interpret and analyse early start reports and plan for next steps in teaching and learning. I encourage you to engage with the other EdTV episodes which unpack the available early start reports in detail. Early Start EdTV episodes share a range of experiences, including an example of how Kedron State School's Early Years Teaching and Learning Program is enriched and strengthened by the implementation of Early Start. Kedron State School uses the Literacy P12 Hub on the Learning Place as a resource to support differentiated teaching and learning for their students. Alignment of Early Start to the Australian Curriculum and used in conjunction with the P10 Literacy Continuum, support schools to plan for every student's progress and success as part of curriculum delivery in all Queensland Early Years classrooms. For more information about Early Start, visit the Early Start website on The Learning Place. Click on the Professional Learning tab to find the Early Start task implementation training videos. These short clips support teachers with strategies for working with students for each of the Early Start assessments. And for information on the Early Start Back to Basics appropriation payment, click on the Support tab. This funding can be used to support the release of teachers so Early Start tasks can be implemented with individual students. The Early Start EdTV episodes provide a step-by-step -step guide for schools implementing Early Start. These can be viewed by individual teachers or used for a whole of school approach to implementing Early Start. For more information, contact the Early Start team 